Hi everyone, I'm Lindsay Duncan, and I'm a certified nutritionist and an ND, and I've been helping people get well with diet and nutrition and supplementation for nearly four decades now. Today we're going to be doing a deep dive into the most nutrient-dense food on planet Earth, chlorella. And after watching this, and of course doing your own research, you will most likely consume chlorella for the remainder of your life. So let's break chlorella down. It's an aquatic superfood. Chlorella is found in the ocean and in freshwater, and it's a member of the green algae family. And it's also a single cell algae. Now chlorella in its natural form can't be consumed by humans, even though it's jam packed with nutrients because it has this extremely hard outer cell wall. Chlorella must be taken in supplement form to reap the many benefits that it provides. The cell wall must be shattered or cracked for all the nutrients to ultimately be liberated and ultimately absorbed by our body. Now this is the reason that a powder form of chlorella is the best option for human consumption. So why should you take notice of chlorella? Consider the following. Number one, one of the main uses of chlorella is purification of wastewater, also known as sewage. Now researchers in the US have found that chlorella is effective in ridding pollutants from wastewater, even at high levels. Okay, so why does that matter to you? You most likely don't work or swim in a sewage plant, right? Right. Trust me, it matters. With the toxins that we're exposed to, I mean, think about it. If chlorella can remove harmful elements like nitrogen and phosphorus from sewage, the natural question that we wanna ask is what harmful things can it remove from my body? My deep dive into this powerful superfood led me to a report where researchers stated the following. When algae was used to clean wastewater, amazing benefits were guaranteed, such as a decrease in the formation of dangerous solid sludge. Now this is from NDPI, which is one of the largest publishers in the world of open access scientific information. Now without getting too gross, how many people out there could use a decrease in the formation of dangerous solid sludge in their bodies. I think you get my point. If chlorella can be used in landfills and sewage plants to remove harmful toxins, then why shouldn't we be using it in our bodies for the exact same reason? Aren't we exposed to hundreds if not thousands of chemicals and preservatives and contaminants and heavy metals and poisons? from the air and the water. What are chlorella's top benefits? Chlorella has amazing antioxidant properties and it has compounds which include chlorophyll, vitamin C, beta carotene, mixed carotenoids, lycopene, and lutein, just to name a few. And these compounds help us to age better and prevent chronic problems later on in life. Research has even shown that chlorella is powerful enough to raise antioxidant levels in smokers. Now that's very impressive. In addition, as I've already touched on, chlorella helps to remove harmful elements, so it's great at detoxing. It's been shown to remove harmful heavy metals, such as cadmium and lead in animal studies. Chlorella can also help support people with high blood pressure, as it promotes a healthy heart and kidney function, which is essential for normal blood pressure. It's even been shown to improve aerobic endurance in some athletes. There was a group of young adults who received six grams, that's 6,000 milligrams of chlorella daily for four weeks, and they reported having increased endurance compared to that of the placebo group. So what's chlorella's nutritional content? Number one, chlorella is extremely nutrient dense. It's 60 to 70% protein and is a complete protein due to it having all nine essential amino acids. It's high in iron and vitamin C, which supports energy and immunity. Chlorella is also a great source of omega-3s, a vegetarian source of omega-3s, which supports brain, nerve, and cardiovascular health. And when taken regularly, as a supplement, it can also be a great source of fiber for digestion. 
Chlorella is so nutritious that even NASA has used it when sending astronauts into space. They've done significant research on the benefits of chlorella and have used it on many space missions. Obviously, they must be extremely selective in their food choice. It must have a long shelf life and be extremely high in nutrients to make the cut. Chlorella made this cut due to its high protein and its high amino acid content, which is even higher than beef. Now, are chlorella and spirulina or spirulina the same? Now, while they're both super beneficial and they both have impressive nutrient profiles and they both are from the algae family, the answer is no. Chlorella is higher in fat and calories and has more omega-3s than spirulina. It's also higher in iron, zinc, magnesium, vitamin A, and the B vitamin riboflavin. Now, spirulina is higher in thymine, copper, maybe slightly higher in protein. So basically they're similar, but their nutritional makeup differs. Now, how can I find chlorella and how can I incorporate it into my daily life? I'll get to that in just a second. But first, if you like this kind of content, be sure to like and subscribe to our page and turn on notifications so you know when we post a new educational video like this. So, like I was saying, the best way to take chlorella is in powder form. Now, you can add it to water with a touch of lemon for flavor or add it to a smoothie or yogurt. Chlorella does have a green taste, which some people like and some people don't. If you're not a fan, a great way to mask the flavor and still get all the great benefits is to add fruits such as bananas or mangoes to your smoothie or to your yogurt. Now you can cook with chlorella by adding it to homemade vinaigrettes and stir fries. It's even possible to add a couple of teaspoons to your recipe the next time you make a baked good, such as banana bread or a muffin. Your food may take on a green tint or color, but that's just proof of the nutrients that this superfood is packed with. My favorite chlorella smoothie is this, a half a cup of dairy-free plain or vanilla yogurt, a half a banana, you can do a little more if you want it sweeter, a quarter of a cup of frozen mango, a half a cup of almond milk or coconut milk, and two scoops or tablespoons of chlorella, powdered chlorella. Seven to 10 cubes of ice, add all the ingredients to a blender, blend and enjoy. That is a super smoothie. So here's the bottom line. And what you really need to know when it comes to chlorella, number one, it helps to remove and shuttle toxins out of the body. It's got a powerful nutrient punch and is a great source of antioxidants, minerals, and vitamins. All of this produces alkalinity in our bodies. And I've said for decades now, when you're green inside, you're clean inside. If you take enough chlorella, your poop will actually turn green. This is a great sign. Now to sum it up, it's clear that there's ample reason why so many people are talking about chlorella. And while there isn't ample research yet, chlorella is also believed to support immunity. In today's world, that's important. It supports cardiovascular health, it supports blood sugar, and it supports cholesterol levels. Just remember, as you look to incorporate this powerful supplement into your regimen, that not all chlorellas are created equally. Make sure your green powder is coming from a reputable and credible source. Make sure it's organic, and most importantly, it's not delivering small doses of chlorella. For example, 250 to 600 milligrams of chlorella would be considered a small dose in my opinion. I highly recommend doses over 1500 milligrams at a minimum. And just for a frame of reference, one five gram serving of chlorella is equal to approximately six to eight large plates of mixed vegetables. Now that's a health hack for sure. In conclusion, Chlorella is a great way to get more greens in our diet. And remember to like and subscribe and even share this content if you find it beneficial. Thanks for watching and I will see you next time.